please confirm are able to hear my voice are able to see my screen yes sir yes sir yes yes sir yes everyone very good everyone yes sir very good yeah yeah yes sir yeah good 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 everyone um i can ask one question please uh, unmute and speak how many types of tr oh sorry how many types of systems in sap types sir how many types of systems madam good anyone three, anyone three types three types three types what is that uh, production quality and development development you can come from the development we already discussed na so we already discussed development quality development quality and production production okay and uh, <clears throat> i will ask one question what is the full form of sap system application and products for data processing very good system application products for data process um what is meant by r by 3 r by 3 bole to r uh, what is meant by r r means tell me sir r means sir real time three type structures real time three type architecture three type three type real time data process three means three bole to three servers three, three layers three layers what is that a presentation layer application layer and database layer database layer okay database layer okay how many modules in sap jansi tell me modules fico a how many Hello? more than i can give a number actually more than more 17 More than thirty-seven modules. Thirty-seven. More than thirty-seven. Yeah. <clears throat> um. Uh. Yes, SAP started at which year? Nineteen seventy-two. Nineteen seventy. Okay. Um. Other people can please respond. Um. Like. Uh, what is uh sap belongs to which country germany 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 germany, germany country very good um sap full form who started sap Five IBM, 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 IBM employees. Five IBM employees. Who that? What is the five IBM names? X employees. X employees. Ah. What is him names, madam? Hoop, Hector, Hector huh? Plantner. Hoop, Hector, Plantner. That's all yeah. I remember, sir. Very good, madam. Appreciate. Basically, I did not tell the names actually, but you analyze very good. Appreciate. Hmm. Yeah. So everyone, I will tell you one thing. I will tell you one thing, everyone. Now, before going to before going to start enterprise structure, before going to start enterprise structure, you people want to understand. We already discussed. We already discussed how many types of servers. example uh, basically we have four types of servers everyone one is a uh, development server quality server and production server these three things we are called as a landscape on the project class we will discuss in depthly and one more server we have it's called sandbox or idos system this is we can use for the practicing purpose even in the real time also we can use this system for the practicing purpose okay some people sitting in the bench na some people sitting in the bench so that time the company will give you the sandbox server they said to do practice something even they will provide you some type of documents even some type of videos they give instruction to uh, update your skill like that 
even uh, companies also giving some type of trainings or some type of uh, kt sessions and all so you need to attend that uh, sessions then you want to practice company also provide same type of uh, server whatever we are practicing now this is called sandbox actually sandbox server so the company also providing same type of server for the practicing whenever you are sitting in the bench that time they will provide you okay so majorly if the interviewer will ask the question anyway some overview we have uh, three types of servers one is a development server then one is quality server one is production server one is production server everyone now today now before going to before going to start the enterprise structure everyone concentrate here concentrate here everyone listen don't do any other activities don't practice don't do any other activities listen carefully listen 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 carefully <clears throat> everyone now my question is today you people want to understand how many how many types of data in sap how many types of data in sap data in sap then what is mean by tr how to create the tr how to create the tr how to save the data in tr you people want to understand before going to start the enterprise structure any day means this is the overview actually uh, and in depthly we will discuss in the project class sir you want to ask uh, sir why everything in project class everyone uh, types of servers types of data and these things is important in the project class actually that is not a configuration okay important project class we will discuss in depthly anyway try to understand types of data <clears throat> everyone basically who have four types of data everyone entire sap co entire sap api co we have four types of data one is everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here how many types of data data in sap that is my question listen carefully we have four types of data four types of data one is one is program data i mean programming programming data one is configuration data configuration data one is master data don't write listen first listen just listen okay just listen everyone that's it i will give you time to write listen if you if you see uh, mahesh babu movie we don't write anything if you see bahubali we don't write anything but we after the movie we will tell everything how devasena how bahubali how we sadnuska everything everything we will tell why because we are listening seeing listening properly if you listen everything will going to store into their mind okay everyone concentrate here we have four types of data one is program data configuration data and master data then one is called transactional data transactional data everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here everyone basically basically in the sap two types of consultants is there how many types of consultant two types of consultants one is technical consultant technical consultant and one is functional consultant functional consultant sir who is the technical consultant and who is the functional consultant everyone concentrate here everyone who is the technical consultant and who is the functional consultant technical consultant means who write the program example abap who learn the abap 
cool on the abap abapper abapper is called technical consultant abapper is called technical consultant they will write the program they will update the program they will uh, correct it the program who will uh, write the program who will update the program who will uh, uh, do the program program related thing take care by the abapper abapper okay abapper who is the functional consultant functional consultant means like uh, fi consultant and co consultant and mm consultant and sd consultant and pp consultant dot 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 etc etc except abapper all the consultants is called functional consultants functional consultants everyone so we are fi consultant maybe co consultant we are fi consultant co consultant we are called functional consultant we are the functional consultants okay so everyone this technical consultant is responsible by the program data technical consultant is responsible by the program data functional consultant functional consultant means like fi consultant mm consultant sd consultant pp consultant so this type of consultants so this type of consultant is understand this type of consultant especially as a finance consultant these people want to understand what is meant by transactional data what is meant by master data and what is meant by configurational data we are not responsible by program data why because as a functional consultant we don't write any type of program you don't want to learn other programs c c plus plus java and uh, abap no not required for that things we are the functional consultant so what we will do functional consultant what we will do i will explain in the class what the functional consultant will do what the end user will do i will ask one question on the development server consultant will do the configuration on which screen please unmute and respond spr spr spro screen or img screen hi spr screen or img screen very good thanks for respond so everyone everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here we have transactional data master data and configurational data sir what is meant by transactional data you just try to understand as a finance try to understand try to understand fi co prospective don't think mm don't think pp don't think other model you can think you are the responsible fi co you can think as a fi consultant co consultant like that <laughs> transactional data means everyone transactional data means accounting entry postings data what is mean by transactional data transactional data means accounting entry postings postings data sir what type of accounting entry postings we will do gl accounting entries vendor accounting entries vendor invoice vendor payment vendor credit memo customer invoice customer payment customer credit memo bank related accounting entries asset related accounting entries all type of accounting entries if you post any accounting entry some value should be reflected if you post any accounting entry some value should be reflected that accounting entries data is called accounting entries data is called transactional data transactional data means simple terminology accounting entries accounting entries data so where you will post this accounting entries on which screen 
Tell me, my dear student. SAP Easy Access Screen. Very, very good. Tell me, example, SAP Easy Access Screen. Easy Access Screen. We will post all type of accounting entries. Vendor accounting entry, customer accounting entry, GL accounting entry, bank accounting entry, all type of accounting entries we will post into the SAP Easy Access screen. Everyone, example, what is meant by master data? Accounting entries means like any GL document entry posting, vendor accounting entry posting and all. Now you can come to master data. Come to master data. What is meant by master data? What is meant by master data? Master data means, everyone, consider it here. Master data means, if you want to post any accounting entry, you require some master data. For example, everyone, for example, I want to post one accounting entry. Example, rent, account data to cash. I want to post this accounting entry. Example, 10,000 and 10,000. If I want to post this accounting entry, first, what I do? First, I want to create rent GL. Then I want to create cash GL. Then I need to post. Rent GL creation is the master data. Rent is one of the GL master data. Cash is one of the GL master data. First, we need to create GL. For example, I want to post one accounting entry. Example, contractor, contractor, fee, account, data to vendor, Ramesh and Dupo. Ramesh and Dupo. So who is this contractor fee means what? This is the GL. And who is this Ramesh? Ramesh is the vendor. So if you want to post this accounting entry, first what you need to do? First you need to create that. One time activity, first you need to create. Contractor fee is the GL. Ramesh and Co is the vendor. First you want to create that. Then later you want to post. Later, you want to post. So what happened here? Example, master data means, master data means, example, everyone, example, GL creation, GL creation, example I'm telling, GL creation, vendor creation, vendor creation, and customer creation, Customer creation, asset creation, asset creation, and dot 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 etc. etc. Dot dot etc. If you want to post the information, first you need to create the master data. Then only you will post the accounting entries. Then only you will post the accounting entries. It's called, for example, where you can do this activity. Where you will do, where you will, where you will, uh, example, where you will create the master data, where you will create the master data. We will create the master data on SAP Easy Access screen. We will create the master data on SAP Easy Access screen. Okay. The next one, <laughs> next one, what is meant by configurational data? If you want to create master data, if you want to create master data, you need to do some configuration. Example, enterprise structure creation, enterprise structure, company creation, company code creation, configuration. Configuration means everyone, whatever activity, everyone, concentrate here. Whatever activity you do on SPRO screen or IMG screen, whatever activity you do on SPRO screen. So what you did in the SPRO screen? I will tell you. Example, enterprise structure creation, global parameters configuration, 
new GL configurations, lot of things it will come. Whatever activity you can check during the entire classes, whatever activity you do in the SPR was screen, that is called configuration. That is called configuration. Example, you can do anything, enterprise structure creation, new GL configuration, chart of accounts, setups, everything, everything, whatever activity you do on SPRO screen, that activity is called configurational data. Okay, SPRO screen, whatever activity you do in the SPRO screen, activities. activities on SPRO screen. Whatever things you did in the SPRO screen, that is called a configurational data. Everyone, everyone in the SAP, you do any topic. If you take any topic, GL, new GL, example, you take any topic, GL, AP, accounts payable, accounts receivable, asset accounting, banking, CO, MM, SD, you can take any topic. As a functional consultant, first we will do the configuration related settings you need to do. First we will do the configuration. Then later we will create the master data. Then later we will create the trend accounting entry postings. Finally, we will generate the reports. That is a different one. Reports. Finally, we will generate the reports. How the reports will go into generated? If you post the accounting entry, then only reports will go into generate. If you post accounting entry, then only GLS reports will go into generate. Without accounting entry posting, there is a no uh, reports. There is a no reports. Okay. So basically, three types of data. You can you can do any any objective. First, we will do the configuration on SPRO screen. For later, we need to create the master data. Then later, we need to post transaction accounting entry posting. Finally, we will generate the reports. You need to ask, sir, in case if I miss anything, sir, you tell this topic, but you did not show me the reports. Where, for example, if you take any topic, if you take any topic, so which level you need to understand as a consultant, as a consultant, which level you people want to understand? If you take any topic, you people want to understand for this topic, any topic, for this topic, what is the configuration? What is the master data required? What is the accounting entries required? What type of reports we are going to generate? So for specific topic, you can analyze, you can analyze for this topic, what type of configuration is required? What type of master data is required? What type of uh, accounting entry postings is required? What type of reports is required? So what level you people want to understand when next class onwards? Next class onwards, if I start enterprise structure, next class onwards, you people want to understand. Okay, better. Everyone, can you please note it down this? First, note it down, madam.
Done. Noted, everyone. Done, sir. Done. Uh, somebody asking question. Now time to ask the question, everyone. Yes, please. Anyone? Anyone? Any doubts? Sir, GM land creation, customer creation are done by end users, sir. It's, it's depends, madam. It depends. It depends. Sometimes uh, end user will create. Sometimes consultant will create. In the production system, answer is yes, end users will create. Otherwise, they will recruit one team. The team name is called Master Data Team, uh, MDG, Master Data Governance Team. For example, if you joined any big four uh, companies, Deloitte, uh, then KPMG, this type of companies, they can, their clients recruited separate team, MDG team. So that teams will going to create, okay? It's depend upon the situation. So uh, uh, the production system on the production server, end user will going to create. Answer is yes. Sir, and uh, Apabus uh, will use uh, will use to configure the uh, fields, sir. In, okay. in which in which language, sir, they will be using Apabus. And that information you not required, madam. No, just okay. which language not required? Okay. We, we are not write any type of program. Okay. So that information not required. Okay. Why don't think ABAPR? We are not write any type of program here. Okay. Next, next one, next question. Yeah. <clears throat> everyone, concentrated everyone, concentrated everyone. So concentrate here. Now you people want to understand, you people want to understand. So one is types of data. How many types of data in the interview you want to tell? As a functional consultant, as a functional consultant, we can analyze three types of data. One is configurational data, then master data, then document transactional data, document entries data, transactional data. Program data, we are not responsible. We are not deal with that program data take care by the ABAPR technical people. We are not write any type of program. Okay. We are not write any type of program. Okay. Yeah. Even we are not update any type of program. No, we are not involved in program activities. Don't, uh, don't learn C, C++, Java, Oracle. No, not required that. Not required uh, that uh, things to update. Not required that skill. Okay, you can learn just a simple this thing. <clears throat> everyone, everyone, concentrate here, everyone. Sir, before going to uh, TR, I will tell you one thing, everyone. Basically, basically, if you want to sustain in the real time, basically, if you want to sustain in the real time, what skill is required? What skill is required? For example, our SAP FICO course, FICO S for HANA changes or S for HANA. This SAP FICO plus S for HANA course around we will teach five months. Example, around we will teach five months. Sir, this five months. Sir, this five months. Uh, is there any skill I want to update apart from the SAP? Why, why I want to learn only SAP? Is there any other skill I want to update? Everyone, answer is yes. In case if you put four to five years of experience, 
what objectives you required apart from the sap fico apart from the sap fico what objectives is required everyone first one you required first one you required ms office ms office is required apart from the sap fico what objectives is required ms office is required excel excel ms word powerpoint especially these three things is very important for example as a consultant sometimes we want to give presentations to the uh, end users end user does not know anything we need to explain to the end users you need to create one ppt like that then you need to explain the end users most important very very important some all type of reports we are export to the excel then on the excel we are going to analyze in the real time how to export the data sap to excel so ms word we are creating different different type of documents so in the especially in the ms office ms word excel and powerpoint these three things is very important very very important if you know only basics then you can update your skill if you know good faculty you can contact them if you don't know any faculty you can contact me i will give you one excellent faculty number okay i i know one excellent faculty for to who teach ms office and all okay <clears throat> and everyone one more one more skill what 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 skill is required what skill is required everyone you can update your spoken english everyone spoken english you can go and attend the inter you can go and join the spoken english sir is really required the spoken english everyone for example if you pay if you pay 3000 or 4000 to spoken english guy you don't expect you are become a english man no so what you want to tell what you want to expect from their end what you want to what type of spoken english is required here everyone whatever sap subject you are learning here whatever sap subject is you are learning here that thing you want to tell the interview on english so you if you joined a, any office you want to speak it in english okay not in hindi not in telugu or not in any your mother tongue better you need to speak in english at least at least you want to discuss in the interview after the interview if you join any company obviously you want to speak obviously your english skill going to improve if you speak you, the skill is going to improve at least if you crack the interview how much english is required minimum you need to speak your self introduction your subject point of view you are overall things you need to discuss in the interview overall things minimum that much of english is required english soft skills is very important why because if you put 4 to 5 years of exp experience they will give you minimum 1 lakh to 1.5 lakh salary if you want to give if they want to give 1 lakh rupee salary so they will expect more they will check their communications their soft skill okay they are even how ms office also very important they don't ask ms office in the interview but if you want to sustain in the real time ms office is very important then everyone what is meaning by what is other things is required minimum typing speed is required everyone minimum typing speed minimum typing speed is required don't write any exams in the typing minimum typing speed is required for example if for example if you joined any company if you joined any company some time nowadays they are calling come to office if you go any office sometimes you are there your manager stand uh, in front of you okay my dear uh, punnam venkat do this activity do that activity they will they will speak with you so even whenever your manager in your place 
if you type a for apple b for ball <laughs> if you type like like that they will think is really have experience or not why is typing a for apple like that no min minimum typing skill also is required then one more what skill is required if you want to earn 1.5 lakh rupees per month 1 lakh rupees salary per month then you require these things one more one more things what you require everyone basic basic accounting information is required everyone basic accounting knowledge so maximum people bcom mcom you know you people knows this basic but non commerce students uh, so you can call me later i will suggest you one books actually you can read every day half an hour 10 minutes you can read of course in our class we will discuss all account all accounting entries all master data all configuration everything we will discuss in the class apart from this at least you need to uh, read what is mean by capital what is mean by shares at least you can read something then that can be helped basic accounting information basic accounting information is required everyone if you want to sustain in the real time this activity is minimum this skill is required everyone if you know properly this skill nobody stop you after three months or four months you are become a team lead you are become a, a manager you will get 30 lakhs 40 lakhs do you know how much salary my manager oh no do you, everybody know just guess how much my manager salary anyone guess unmute and speak guess just guess 25 lakhs 48 lakhs per annum my manager salary if you know this skill if you know this skill one day you 100 percent reach if you join any company, automatically your skill will going to improve. At least now you want to enter 48 to 47 lakhs in between. My manager is not a man. Actually, she is woman. You know, sometimes regularly we see visit uh, abroad. So how how the luxury life will become? So do you want that luxury life then? Properly, you want to yeah. one second. Everyone, so I'm back everyone. Sorry, sorry everyone. Everyone, so my manager, my manager is not in America, not in any other abroad. His job location in Hyderabad location. <laughs> so everyone, you also become a superman <laughs> when you properly learn this subject. Okay. Yeah, so come to my thing, everyone. So, who, wh how many types of data? 
One is configurational data, master data, and transactional data. Master data and transactional data. How many types of systems? We have three types of systems. Development system, quality system, and production system. Note it down. Put the heading of TR. Note it down, everyone. Put the heading of TR, transport request, and note it down. Put the heading of TR and note it down. <coughs> TR, full form is called transport request. Note it down. TR, full form is called transport request. Transport request. TR, note it down. TR, TR is like one vehicle. TR like a vehicle. Vehicle, truck, lorry, like that. TR like a vehicle. Note it down clearly, everyone. TR like a vehicle. It is help. It is help to move the configurational data. To move the configurational data. To move the configurational data, one system to another system, one system to another system, and within the system, within the system, within the system, one place to another place like that. TR is one vehicle. What it will do? It will move configurational data one system to another system and within the system one place to another place one client to another client like that okay within the system within the system just note everyone okay for your next next line note it down in the standard sap in the standard sap we have two types of TRs. We have two types of TRs. One is one is customizing TR. Customizing TR. And one is workbench TR. Customizing TR and workbench TR. Next line, note it down. Guys, this is for our understanding purpose, okay? Just for the note. <coughs> Later, I will send you interview question and answers, okay? There you can analyze more. Next line, note it down. Customizing TR. Next line, note it down. Customizing TR. Customizing TR. used by the functional consultant customizing tr used by the functional consultant to move configurational data to move configurational data To move configurational data one system to another system 
and within the system. Example, development system to quality system. Development system to quality system. Next line. Workbench TR, workbench TR, workbench TR, used by the technical consultant, used by the technical consultant for the program update. For the program update. So now everyone, you can unmute and speak. So now FI consultant, CO consultant, MM consultant, we are the functional consultant. Which TR we want to use? Workbench or customizing? Customizing. Customizing. Okay. Customizing TR. Very good. Next line noted down. Next line noted down. Put the star and note it down. Put the star and note it down. <clears throat> Put the star and note it down. TR can help. TR can help. Only configurational data. Uh, otherwise, don't not like that. Once again, everyone. TR can move only configurational data. You can write like that instead of uh, help, or you can write like this. TR can move only configurational data. Only configurational data. Put a pull stop and note it down. Pull stop and note it down. If you do, if you do any activity, if you do any activity, master data and transactional data, master data and transactional data, TR cannot update. TR cannot update. TR cannot update. TR cannot update. Okay. Last one, note it down. To create the TR, to create the TR, T code uh, SC10 or SC09 also they can use, but you can note it down SC10. SC10, T code, T code is called SC10. Okay, so can anyone please read the note? Remaining people, please check it out. Everyone who can read, Saurabh, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, transport request. Uh, transport request TR. Is my voice audible? Ah, please. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, please. So, uh, TR is like a vehicle. It helps to move the configurational data from one system to another system and within the system. In standard SAP, we have two types of TR. One is customizing TR and another one is workbench TR. So in customizing TR, uh, used by the 
for uh, yes the customizing tree are used by the functional consultant to move configurational data from one system to another system and within the system example dev to quality system so and then workbench tr used by the technical consultant for the program update in uh, tr uh, tr it can help to move only the configurational data if you do any activity master data and transactional data tr cannot update to create the tr t code is se10 or se09 okay se10 okay good good yeah. okay everyone very good so everyone what you want to do what you people want to understand here everyone what you people want to understand here where you will do this master data on sap easy access screen where you will do the transactional data on sap easy access screen where you will create the configurational data on spro screen so what you people want to understand here if you do any activity on spro screen tr will generate if you do any activity in sap easy access screen master data and configurational data tr cannot generate but simple please keep it on your mind please keep it on your mind please keep it on your mind if you do any activity in the spro screen uh, that is called configuration tr can generate if you do any activity in the e sap easy access screen like master data creation accounting entry posting tr cannot generate it then you want to ask one question actually you people want to ask one question sir okay configurational data if you move one system to another system we can use the tr then how we can move uh, master data and transactional data guys that will come later okay basically we need to use idocs and all idoc process and all if i tell idoc then you people will going to confuse that will come later everyone not required now now <clears throat> so everyone in the configuration spr sap spr was screen here example tr will generate example tr will generate here in the sap easy access screen for the master data tr will not generate okay tr will not will not generate okay and the for the transactional data also tr will not generate everyone tr means it's not like a, a bigger one no not like that for example example for your understanding purpose what we will do we will create uh, one number everyone tr means here it will generate one number example it will going to generate one like one link link like that it will going to generate one link like that so whenever you configure anything all the information will going to save into this link then this link will move here to there here to here like that here will one number will going to generate for your understanding purpose i am saying like that tr means if you do if you create tr for your understanding purpose one link will going to generate means one number will going to generate okay so for example this is the to understand here you people can understand how to create the tr how to create the tr how to save the data how to save the data which type of data configurational data in tr in tr sir how to release that tr how to move the data one system to another system that will come later that not required now no let's under after some subject we will discuss okay now you people want to understand how to create the tr and during the configuration on your configuration how to save your configuration into tr that is your activity very 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 simple tr create that is that is sap 
it's a lengthy software it's a vast subject but it is not a tough actually it's not a tough it's not a hard no no but you people want to understand in the proper manner then only it will become easy <laughs> okay so if you understand here and there here and there you won't cover everything in one day no not like that if i tell all the things in within one month you people cannot understand you people learn proper channel when which subject want to understand you can follow me then only you can balancingly learning balancingly understand if you go here and there then gone why because it's a lengthy process actually okay come to my things everyone how to create the tr se 10 or se 09 also some people can use maximum people use se 10 sir what what we will do what we will do very simple everyone very simple go to sap let's open the sap let's open the sap then enter username and password If you enter username and password, so SAP will going to open. Yeah. So everyone, concentrate here, everyone. So here, what is the T code, everyone? This is called, what is this? What is this? What is this box name? Command box. Command, Command box. box. Very good. It's called command box. Very good, everyone. Thanks for responding. So here, what is the T code? SE 10. 10. Enter here SE 10. Everyone, very simple, everyone. Go to SE 10. Press enter. Press enter. Press enter. <clears throat> One screen will going to open. So everyone, here two types of things. Workbench TR and customizing TR. Which one I want to select? Customizing. Customizing. Customizing TR. Why? That is used by the functional. That is used by function. oh. functional. We consultant. are the functional consultant. We are the functional consultant. That is the reason. Configuration. Ah, very good. Very good. Customizing TR. So select here customizing TR. Then click on here create. Yeah. Click on here create. So here customizing TR, two types of TR, customizing and workbench. Now we are following customizing. Then click on here, okay. So here simply you can write your TR name. Example, I am writing example, PM group of company, PM groups, PM groups implementation project implementation project simply here you can write the description pm group implementation project then click on your save that's it tr will going to generate that's it tr this is the tr number this is called sub tr and this is called main tr Sir, why sub TR and why main TR? Where, how to release the TR? That discussions will come later, everyone. Now, you people want to understand how to create the TR. How to create the TR. Very simple, everyone. It's like a vehicle, actually. It is like a vehicle. Okay, don't release. Just create the TR. How to create the TR? I'm repeating once again, everyone. I'm repeating once again. Go to SE 10, press enter. One screen will come. Here you can select customizing TR, then click on your create. Sim select here customizing TR again, then click on your OK. Here simply you can write the name. What is the activity you want to do? 
what is the activity you want to do you can write the name then click on your save so automatically tr will going to generate this is the functional consultant activity to create the tr how simple how simple not releasing now not releasing now this is called tr releasing and all it will come later okay everyone uh, now uh, guys anyone any doubts anyone any questions to create the tr how to create the tr sir what is the root for tr sir instead of huh? root 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 for tr root yes sir root will come today you can learn how to create if i tell root cause and all then it's gone Compl you can't, can't understand do you understood whatever i explain you can ask the question on that that thing remaining things will come later everyone do you understood how to create the tr and what is meaning of tr sir can you give one example huh. for uh, tr within the system sir within the system means i yesterday i, I explained na uh, madam again development divided into two part or three parts like uh, you know okay, okay, sir. okay sir. yesterday i tell na one part to another part how to move uh, on the project class i will tell you ma'am okay sir. yeah yeah sir uh, if uh, tiers uh, uh, can't be created in uh, sap is access now how the data will be uh, transferred sir when we how the data come again uh, you how the data are going to save i will tell you next point that is only na how to save the data in tr With, without transportation and request uh, we cannot change we cannot save the data na sir answer is yes Uh, then how the data will be transferred <clears throat> from sap easy access screen sir see <clears throat> sap easy if you do anything in the sap easy access screen that is directly will going to update in the server so here it will going to proper channel tr to server like that okay there we need to use the idoc process you will when, when you move to one server to another server here tr you people try to understand tr what is the use of tr like that okay do you got my point everyone mom do uh, sorry do you got ma'am my point yes sir yes sir yes yeah yeah, yeah. <clears throat> thanks everyone everyone now in my first point is first topic is called now up to now the basic settings now now we are entering into the picture first topic is called enterprise structure organization structure up to now whatever activity we did that is the basic settings basic understanding even that basic understanding on the project class we will involve more now you people want to understand organization structure or enterprise structure organization structure or enterprise enterprise structure enterprise structure or organization structure example everyone i will tell you one thing everyone i will tell you one thing i want to implement i want to implement pm group of company pm group of company reliance group of company tata group of company okay example any company any company everyone example example my one is pm group of company pm group of company leave the sap you try to tell me how organization look like that reliance group of company tata group of company and uh, ramco group of companies you will find like this type of companies group of companies under this group of company we have individual companies we have individual companies example example everyone we have individual companies 
what is that exam leave the sap leave the sap don't think the sap you, you can tell me general thing what generally what you people want to understand example under pm group of company we have two individual companies example pm steels private limited or pm example uh, cement limited then uh, pm steels private limited then pm insurance corporate limited cm pm motors private limited under the group of company we have individual companies example everyone example example everyone uh, tata group of companies under the tata group of company tata insurance limited tata it it private limited and tata motors and tata any other things under the group of company we have individual companies under the individual companies what you people understand everyone what you see what the thing tell me in company what you observe what you observe anyone each and every company has their functionality huh? your voice is not audible actually sir each and every company has their own functionality like insurance is a separate thing and uh, like example everyone is every company thing. i will tell you i will tell you every company example every company who have uh, branches who have uh, every company who have branches yes sir no everyone branches yes sir so first group of company later uh, individual companies later we have branches example uh, let it be example uh, for example for example everyone we have uh, branches for every company we have branches example pm hyderabad branch and uh, pm Bengaluru branch, PM Bengaluru branch, and PM uh, Pune branch, and PM uh, Mumbai branch. Okay, branches. Apart from this, what you observe, everyone? Apart from this, what you observe? What you observe? Different departments will be there. Are excellent answer. Who is he? Very good, Sai. Excellent answer. So even in the company, we observe in the departments. We observe in the department. Uh, every company will have the departments. Uh, example, uh, uh, finance department, marketing department, marketing department, and... Uh, and uh, hr department and uh, sales department sales department blah 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 xyz etc blah 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 xyz etc then uh, <clears throat> under the company what do you observe what do you observe everyone what do you observe one is group of company one is individual companies uh, one is uh, branches, one is the departments. Apart from this, financial prospective, we will find segment. We will find the segments actually. Do you know segments? Segments. Segments means example, everyone. <laughs> example. <clears throat> I will tell you one thing, everyone. I will tell you one thing. Reliance group of company. Concentrated everyone. First, leave the SAP. SAP ki chod do. First, try to understand the organization. How look like? Everyone is a great people. I know you have more than knowledge me. Okay, you have more knowledge compared to me in the organization. 
of course sap i have knowledge that's a different thing just orally orally just think everyone concentrate here everyone basically i am telling reliance group of company under the reliance we have different different private limited example reliance trends reliance supermarkets reliance oil oil reliance oil limited under the reliance oil we have two segments one is diesel reliance i mean diesel manufacturing and one is petroleum petrol diesel and petrol diesel is one segment petrol is one segment segment somebody says na within the company somebody i don't know here surab uh, somebody says different different uh, objectives it's called segments it's called as a segments actually okay and uh, example even in my companies also we have the segments my companies also we have the segments and uh, what type of segments we have what type of segments we have uh, example in my companies also we required some segments example uh, we'll make some down even my companies also we have some segments and uh, a pm steels private limited na cement cement example cement pm uh, opp opp cement segment cement segment and uh, pm ppp cement segment and pm steel steel uh, steel sheet segment sheet steel sheet segment and uh, pm steel rod segment segment but like so it segments okay segments different different segments example everyone example i will tell you one thing uh, i have one manufacturing company i have one manufacturing company in the manufacturing company i have two segments one is electronical goods segment one is a uh, plastic manufacturing segment plastic manufacturing segment segments example i have uh, i have uh, which one A any other things okay segments you know segments okay so apart from this what you people of job apart from this what you people of job anyone anyone tell me no na no. sir let it be some more things we will update during the sap everyone everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here in the sap term non sap terminology non sap terminology we are called group of companies non sap terminology we are called group of companies in the sap terminology we are called just company guys try to understand the terminology everyone try to understand the terminology company for example everyone in hindi in hindi language we are called as a pani in uh, telugu we are called as a manch neelu in english we are called as a water but objective is same concentrate here everyone concentrate here very important you joined here class listening the class don't think here and there i know your mind is going here and there listen listen carefully you want 1 lakh rupees salary per month then listen focus do you want to achieve 50 lakh rupees per, per annum in the future just listen no sir i am happy with 20000 then please don't join the class tomorrow onwards not required to listen the class okay you want money power then listen the class 
ओके ओके लिजन लिजन माय डियर फ्रेंड्स एवरीवन कंसंट्रेट हियर एवरीवन फॉर एग्जांपल फॉर एग्जांपल फॉर एग्जांपल इन फॉर एग्जांपल इन हिंदी वी आर कॉल्ड एज ए पानी इन तमिल एनीवन तमिल व्हाट वी कॉल्ड इन तमिल एवरीवन तनीर तनीर जस्ट कंपनी in the general terminology we are called as a individual company individual company but in the sap terminology everyone in the sap terminology we are called as a company code the sap terminology we are called as a company code company hari krishna company code okay and uh, example example everyone in the general terminology in the general terminology we are called as a departments we are called as a department like uh, you know finance department hr department blah 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 etc we are called as a department in the sap terminology especially in the sap fi especially in the sap fi terminology we are called anyone anyone knows functional area i think excellent everyone excellent we are called as a functional area functional area means for example if you join any company they are called create one functional area means what you want to create you want to create departments we want to create departments you want to create department okay functional area they are called they don't call department no they are try to understand the terminology terminology is very important here how to create the functional area i will tell you that is the different but you people want to understand from the basics from the basics what is mean by this what is mean by that that level you need to understand okay so for example this is called segments so segments in the sap terminology we are called as a segment even in the non sap terminology also we are called as a segment non sap terminology also we are called as a segment i mean so non sap we are called segment in the sap terminology also we are called as segment example everyone here here in the non sap terminology we are called as a business areas sorry non sap terminology we are called as a branches hyderabad branch bengaluru branch pune branch like that but some people here some people treat branches means here we are called as a business area business area business area okay everyone try to understand here try to understand group of, here we are called as a group of company here we are called as a company both are same just terminology is different that's it in the real time they are called as a create one company means what you want to create you need to create group of company then here they people called as a company code the people called as a company code company code means individual company it's a legal entity what is mean by company code how to create the company code it will come don't everything won't cover in one class okay and uh, in the non sap terminology we are called as a branches here we are called as a business area here we are called as a segment here also we are called as segment 
here we are called as a department here we are called as a functional areas some more points also will come some more objectives also will come during the configuration i will tell you everyone do you understood everyone what i am telling yes no okay yes sir yes sir yes sir do you want to write do you want to write yes, do you want i can give you 2 minutes of time note it down fast everyone Done. Noted, everyone. Yes, sir. Sir, small correction, sir. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, OPC cement, PPC cement, sir. At Just like cement, segments, sir. OPC yeah. cement, uh, segments. I said you know, for example, I am the yeah. oil example. Uh, I am the manufacturer company. Example, I can manufacture one segment for the uh, electronical goods, one segment from the plastic goods, plastic segment, electronical segment like that. For example, I am the oil oil related company, Reliance Oil Private Limited. One is for the uh, uh, diesel um, purifier segment. One is petroleum purifier segment like that. You can divide the segment. That is my intention. Okay. Got my point? Yeah, okay, sir. But actually, that is a OPC PPC, sir. Actually, a OPP cement PPP cement. You can try it. Anyway. Okay. Sir. Done, everyone. Done. Done. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Uh, maybe, uh, 
tomorrow no class basically sunday and monday sunday and monday i am available in hyderabad anyone who want to meet me want to discuss any clarification questions but uh, actually i don't want to eat guys nice. one mute my dear friend so uh, i don't want to meet more time half an hour one hour no don't like that i can give you 10 to 15 minutes why because my project is go live actually sunday and monday our project is go live so i am in go live activities uh, so i'm i'm little bit busy but if you are ready to meet me then i can give you 10 to 15 minutes of time so okay to uh, meet then yeah so you can call me okay you people can call me then i can give, tell you the where place and all so yeah maybe you people want to come on gachiboli okay uh, let it be i will tell you the where time and everything address and all you can call me if you are interested means clarification doubts any questions then you can call me okay everyone better you people can uh, ask lakshmi ma'am to add on the whatsapp group okay there i can post some information okay thanks everyone any doubts any doubts any doubts no sir. So, so monday we have class monday i am in hyderabad madam i will tell you i, I will tell you on the group whatsapp okay okay we the next class so thanks everyone thanks for joining let's thank you on. sir not tomorrow next class i will update the time date